All right, temperatures outside this afternoon, not too bad at all into the upper 50s. Nice sunshine around now a few clouds moving in our direction. We did start the day at 31 cold degrees this morning and we're going to drop back into the 30s tonight, but enjoy the evening. The temperatures out there in the 50s and uh, this will be uh, what will be the nicest evening of the week uh, because things start to change in a big way tomorrow. So if you have outdoor plans, you may want to start tucking those garbage cans close to the house and and don't worry about the leaves in the yard. They are going to blow away by the middle of the week. 54 in Newton Falls, 57 in Columbiana, and 58 down in Wellsville. Here's what we have to talk about this evening. A very little weather here at home. That is going to change, though, as we go into tomorrow and especially into Wednesday. I'm watching a couple of areas. There's a tremendous amount of moisture in the southern United States tonight. Uh, this is what is left of a lot of moisture from Patricia, a big uh, hurricane that moved into Mexico and Texas, now moving northward. I'm also watching watching to the north. There's another storm system pivoting around the northern part of the country. This storm is going to absorb this system and sling it right up in our direction as we go into Wednesday. With it, we're going to get a lot of wind energy moving on in and a lot of moisture. Uh, the end result, rainy, windy, and even the chance of thunderstorms into Wednesday. So let's go hour by hour here starting this evening. It stays dry for us. Nice out there. Temperatures will dip. Uh, back into the 30s tonight and a few clouds will stroll on through. Uh, tomorrow looks like a pretty nice day overall. A little chilly to start. More clouds around, especially through the afternoon. Uh, by 4 and 5 o'clock, notice how the rain's starting to knock on the door of southern Columbiana County. And that rain will continue to lift on in as we head toward early uh, Wednesday morning. Now the rain will just get heavier as we go through the day Wednesday. It's going to be windy to moderate rainfall possible uh, right into midday. Notice the yellows and oranges starting to show up. That's that heavy rain risk of a thunderstorm too as we go into Wednesday evening and into Wednesday night. Then temperatures start to cool down for us. The showers will taper off a little as we go into Thursday. In the end, we're talking about a lot of rainfall here at home over a short period of time. Better than an inch of rainfall by the time we go into late Thursday and how about the wind gusting 30 to 40 miles per hour or higher as we go into Wednesday and Thursday. This is a sloppy storm system moving in our direction. 36 tonight, partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow, most of the day stays dry uh, by evening. That small chance uh, for an isolated shower, a much better risk of that rain as we go into Wednesday and windy too. Highs in the low 60s, keeping a close eye on that storm system. Cool on Thursday, chance of showers. Friday looks better. Halloween day, not a bad day. Highs in the mid 50s, but by Saturday evening, the chance of showers return as the clocks go back Saturday night into Sunday. But Dave, don't worry. By Monday, we're back in the mid 60s and it looks pretty warm into November. But this storm this week is going to be one we have to watch. Tomorrow's pajama day at my niece's school, so it'll be a nice, uh, cool way to start the are, day for Are them. we going to do that? <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, it's a good one. Yeah. They'll need them in the morning. All right, Paul, thanks.